sleeping medications, if you read the labels, none of them are, are, are meant to be used chronically. That is, even if you have an underlying medical condition, sleeping pills are for short-term use. The only medication that has an indication for longer than a month is uh, Lunesta, um, and that's only for six months. What that means is that if you are taking a medication night after night, eventually several things will happen. One is you'll find you can't sleep with that medication. Second is you're doing something that's really outside of what the, the drug was invented for, uh, what it was meant for, and what, it, what it's the prescribing practices of, of, of good medicine go against. Uh, third and, and probably most importantly is we know that people who have sleep disturbance sleep better when they modify their sleep cycle and don't take medications. We just had a study that came out in the Journal of the American Medical Association. So what I'm saying is learning how to think differently about sleep in this case, pain in other cases. Learning how to think differently about a symptom and not look to a medication to treat it, but rather look to behaviors that might improve sleep is really the way to go.